Comic Book Nation, I am your host Chris Killian and welcome to Flashback. Today we have a special guest for you guys. She's appeared on Unfabulous, The Vampire Diaries, and Filthy Sexy Teens, but you guys know her best as Barry Allen's ex-girlfriend Linda Park and Dr. Light from The Flash. Melise Jow, thank you so much for being here with me tonight. Yeah. Thank you. This is awesome. Oh, th thanks. Thank you. It's so awesome to have you. Uh, so far, uh, this has been a pretty good third season of The Flash, but I know a lot of fans are missing you as Linda Park and Dr. Light. Uh, since both characters are still alive, is there any chance that we might see you return to the show in the near future? Hmm? Yeah, it's totally possible, which is exciting. It was a huge honor not only to play Linda, but when they told me that I was going to play Dr. Light as well, I was like, are you kidding me? Two iconic characters in this universe. and I get to say that I've been both. And yeah, they're both alive and well, and um, we'll see what happens. I know we're all rooting for you to come back. Uh, the Flash does share the same universe with Arrow and Legends of Tomorrow, etc. So if she doesn't show up on Flash, there could be plenty of opportunities to show up elsewhere though, right? Very, very true. Yeah, I love everyone involved behind the scenes, um, kind of masterminds behind all of these universes. So um, anything that they do, if they want me to be a part of it, I am so down. Like, I don't, I wouldn't even question <laughs> I really hope they bring you back because I really enjoyed your story arc in the second season as Dr. Light. Uh, well, so a lot of the characters, they've had like alternate versions of themselves, but not everyone has got to appear at the same time on screen as themselves the way you did. Was that challenging, like as an actress, to play dual roles like that? Oh, totally. Actually, I have a funny little career bucket list, and playing a doppelganger sort of thing was like at the top. So the fact that I got the opportunity as an actor to do it was awesome. Um, those episodes were so fun to film. It's very time consuming uh, because you have to shoot one side of the scene as one character and then you have to change and remember the dialogue for the next character when they turn around to do all that stuff. So it was definitely challenging, um, but it was so cool. I have never done anything like it before. Wow, that sounds like that would be tough, but you, you pulled it off. Which version of Linda Park do you think is closer to you in reality? I, I mean, I, I'm sure you're not like Dr. Light, but which, which one did you have more fun playing? Oh my gosh, uh, that's difficult. Let me one up my own answer that I already had and say I liked playing Linda Park as she was trying to be Dr. Light. Boom. Oh, <laughs> wow, that was awesome. Right? Uh, <laughs> no, that, that actually was cool though because Linda's used to being this like, confident, cool, I have everything figured out character. So it was awesome to have her in her, you know, outside of her comfort zone a little bit with, you know, trying to be a super villain. <laughs> right. Well, in the show, you were a love interest for Barry, and I think almost everybody that watches this will know that. But in the comics, she's actually married to Wally West. Uh, if you did come back later on, would you like to come back on the show and maybe have a fling with Wally West and see what kind of dynamic that could stir up between Barry and Iris? Oh, yeah, that would be great. I know a lot of people were kind of confused with Linda dating Barry Allen at first, but now they are introducing Wally and establishing him. And I've definitely gotten some tweets that that's kind of what people want to see next. Um, I feel like Linda and Iris are in a good place and Linda and Barry are in a good place. So it, it might actually be another cool dynamic to the show if they end up bringing on another little love storyline. <laughs> in the comic book film world, characters are constantly being rebooted. So if you had a shot to play any comic book character, like who is your dream role? I don't know, that's difficult. I mean, I've always said that I kind of want to be a Flash. <laughs> I think that would be awesome. I'd love to see a female Flash. No, it would be awesome. I, I mean, the super speed, because my answer, if anyone ever says like, you know, what kind of superpower would you want? I say teleportation, but you know, super speed is like the next best thing, right? Right, yeah. Get some cardio while you're teleporting-ish. Yeah, we've got female Thor now. We've got female Iron Man. Why not throw Flash in the mix? You could be Flash. You could totally do it. Yeah, and, you know, Crimson. Can't go wrong. Well, until we see Linda Park return to the Arrowverse, can you let us know what you're going to be up to uh, or what you're up to currently and where fans can check out what Melise Jow is doing in the meantime? Yeah, for sure. Um, you can keep up with me on Instagram, Twitter. I love hearing from you guys and talking to you. Um, my Instagram is my name, Melise. Jow, and my Twitter is XO Melise. Um, I have a romantic comedy movie coming out next year um, for MTV, their new show Sweet Vicious. I have a, a cool episode doing that and always working on music too. So um, yeah, just follow my socials and uh, we'll keep in touch.
Awesome. Can't wait. That's all for us, guys. Melise, thank you again so much for chatting with me tonight. It was amazing getting to Skype meet you. Yeah, you too. I'll see you later. Yeah, you guys make sure you follow Melise on Twitter at XO Melise and on Instagram at Melise Jow or search for her official page on Facebook. After you go and follow Melise, make sure you guys keep tuning in to watch The Flash every Tuesday night on The CW. If you guys don't already follow us on all of your favorite social media, I don't know how you're watching this, but get to it. At Comic Book on Twitter. Search for us on Facebook. And you can find us on Instagram at Comic Book Now. For ComicBook.com, I'm Chris Killian, and this has been Flashback. Thank you.